COVID-19 has arrived in the Nigerian city of Lagos. We've got more and more cases coming in every day. 30 countries here have now told their citizens that they must stay at home. I think it's clear that things will not be the same as we've known them. And the earlier we accept that things have changed, the better we can adapt. Let's face it, all the strategies that we put together at the beginning of the year have probably been, become obsolete. It's never ever going to be bouncing back to uh, normal. We're going to bounce forward to a new normal. If you look at Nigeria, uh, the oil revenue that used to give us the buffer is seriously challenged due to the price war between Saudi Arabia and Russia. Our oil price benchmark for our budget was based on 57 per dollar. And today, we're looking at a basket price of about $22 per barrel. The immediate impact is the devaluation of our currency by over 10%, and that's just the beginning. What is the impact for us as companies that are operating in this country? Let's face it, all the strategies that we put together at the beginning of the year have probably been, become obsolete. Um, are we going to sit at home and wait for the virus to be over? and then come back to business as usual, it's never ever going to be bouncing back to uh, normal. We're going to bounce forward to a new normal. And what the Also Leadership Academy is attempting to do with these series is to help you and your customers and your, and your staff in the same way that we've been helping you to be efficient and effective when we had these impacts in-house. In the UK, across America, and in the developed world, a lot of things are moving virtual. We have to move virtual as well. And there's no better time than now.